Hey guys, this is Gavin and Sam with First World Survival. Today we're doing our school project. Today we'll be showing you how to create a fire using a D battery and a gum wrapper. Okay, so today what we're going to be doing is a log cabin fire. We'll be using the big sticks for the structure. So these are the pencil size sticks. Then you put it in the container or wherever you're doing the fire. So what you do is you take two sticks about the same size, maybe break them so they fit into your container. And then just make them parallel like this. And then you'll be doing the same thing, but in opposite directions. So it forms a square. And you'll keep doing this until it gets probably like two or three inches high. Okay, so what we're going to be doing now is getting the duff ready. This is, duff is just stuff that's really easy to light. What we'll be doing is getting cotton balls and spreading them apart. And then you, the tree bark's optional because not everyone knows how to do this. And what you do is you put it just in the cotton ball nest, I guess. And you'll put this in the middle of your log cabin fire. And then what you'll do is take some thin sticks and you'll put it on half. You'll put it on top of half of the log cabin. So you leave one side open and then this can catch a flame. Then after you do the small like twigs, I guess, you'll put a little bit bigger stuff just on top so it can keep getting the domino effect by catching other stuff. Okay, so how this works is that when you connect the two sides of the batteries, it sh creates a short circuit and the thinned out part in the middle, oh, I don't have a piece left, but the thinned out part in the middle will get really hot and it creates enough heat to light the fire. Okay, so we're gonna take our battery, our scissors, and the gum wrapper. So we're gonna cut the gum wrapper into a thin strip relatively thin like this and then we're going to take this and we're going to narrow it so it thins out in the center like this and we're going to take our D battery put one side on the positive and one on the negative. And if you guys ever have a fire that's going low, what you do is you gotta give it oxygen and just blow on it to get the flames to spread. 